Ian, a game of two halves really, one in the first half where Kettred really dominated um, the game, played a, a good style of football, let them come on to us, got the goal, good goal from uh, Liam Daly, who I thought played uh, really quite well considering it was his first game. And I think it was Napoleon at Waterloo that said just when anything was going right, everything went absolutely wrong. <laughs> Is that your sort of interpretation of it? Uh, yes and no. I think we had our moments, but we didn't have enough moments. Um, we had a couple of really good good positions um, where we got into and our quality was lacking. Uh, I think our shape was good first half. We let them have the ball and they didn't really hurt us or get behind. Uh, but we just got deeper and deeper. Fair, fair, fair credit to them. They pushed the uh, wide men or, or the full-backs really high and camped us in second half. and it, We found it really hard. But uh, I don't think we had enough moments second half to, to um, make, make a difference. The catalyst of the game really, sort of, I think, depended on that um, offside goal. Was it offside or not? Crawford, it seemed from then on, everything went wrong. Moments later, they get a free kick and um, that was it, basically. Yeah, after the goal went in, I think there was a lot of frustration, a lot of motion, uh, emotion on the pitch. And we, we lost our shape. Uh, a couple of, they got through a couple of times and then we give a free kick away. Uh, but there again, I thought the interpretation on a free kick is you've got to be a metre away. I thought they were very close to the wall. But yeah, that's it. Yeah, so we'll, we'll see on that one. But um, no, I, I, like I said, uh, the, the full credit to them. They, they came and pushed on and they, they camped us in a little bit. Um, but we just didn't have enough good moments and I mean, it looked a little bit of quality in, in, in the final third. The problem we've got now, we lost another one through a sending off, yeah. um, probably a couple of injuries, I'm not sure. There was a, uh, I did see from the commentary box, it looked like a niggle with uh, Connor Barrett and maybe also the goalkeeper took a knock as well. With the other suspensions um, that we've got in place and injuries with Cooper, it must put you really even th bare a thread than we've got already. Yeah, it is. It is it's, it's a worry. I mean, um, we need our better players on the pitch. Uh, and that's, that's no disrespect to anyone else who's going to come in or anything like that, but... Uh, they know the league and, uh, and they know what's required, so we need them as much as possible. Uh, so it it's, uh, uh, puts us in a little bit of a problem area. But whoever comes in again will just have to step up. Uh, there's a chance there for someone now to come in and make a claim for it and uh, they'll get their chance. It does seem that as, just as we get near to, to the uh, playoff positions, everything seems to have uh, turned round, let's say, and um, the anticipation of uh, games being postponed, preparations have been thrown into turmoil. No fault of uh, Catherine's, of course, but uh, at the end of the day, can't be making your job any easier. No, I mean, you lose momentum. Once your games are called off, you lose a bit of momentum. Uh, and the two we've had is just is, is flattened it a little bit. But uh, no, we'll go again with 13 games to go. All to play for in front of us, and then we'll, we'll, we'll give it the best best chance we can. Chester on Saturday, I suppose, as I said earlier, it's going to be a, 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 who's available to play, isn't it? Yep, it will be. Uh, uh, the young boys will be involved, uh, and we'll have a count up during the week and see what we can put out there on a Saturday. Uh, and we might have to change the shape a little bit or do something different, but uh, no, the boys that, will, that will get their opportunity will give it a right good go. Was there ever a thought during the game that you'd have to bring on, on Davis as a goalkeeper? No, 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 no. no he's, he's not ready yet. Uh, we just wanted to include him because he's a part of it. Um, we wanted to get him back involved. No, Jacko's good as gold. Yeah, uh, he's all right. Um, and I thought Liam, Liam was excellent on his debut, really was. Big leader there for us. And like we said, we just need our players on the pitch now uh, to regroup and we'll, we'll go again. OK, Ian, sorry about the defeat. Nothing that we, we could do about it, but uh, that's it. We'll see you at Chester. Yes, see you then.